Hi everyone, before we start your video, I just want to let everybody know that I am doing the one question reading um, for right now just the no contact. That's the only question that I'll be entertaining. Um, and these are fast, quick readings. I get you in, I get you out. And it's very expensive, just so for people who are wondering. Um, you can go in the description box below. You can check it out. And the turnaround for this one is in the next 24 hours, okay? So if you're a person who's who has a situation right now and there's no contact and you just need the answer right here, right now, it's very easy. You go there in the description box and you will choose the no contact. That's the only thing available there. I will send you a video back. And that's it. You don't need to send me a question anymore because I know you're no contact. I don't need your chart. I just need your name and I know your situation. There is no contact and I will read you for that, uh, for, um, for that question. And then that gets directly sent to your email. So make sure that you put your correct email because a video file will be sent to you. Now, these are not for everyone because, you know, you, there's always a free reading that I upload on YouTube. But for, for other people who likes to have... Um, readings like this where it's personal um, well you can go it in the description box below thank you very much guys and let's proceed to your reading hi Aquarius welcome to my channel we're doing your reading how are you let's uh, before we start um, my recommendation <laughs> last time I recommended for the Aquarius rose quartz a lot of people <laughs> of course <laughs> you know it's into love and self-healing gorgeous but right now what I feel like I'm you know I would want you guys to work with as crystal wise if you guys are in the same journey as me or trying to transform your your career finances also manifesting of course abundance prosperity in your life we all know okay the wonderful citrine okay so now right hand to increase okay so wear it in the right hand okay i'll put this in the view products here there's this there's a thing here you tap that you will see the citrine or you can if you scroll below you will see it also a picture of it already and it's easy check out you can um you can check it out okay this is citrine and i'll even put a code here you can use uh, see i'm just thinking about this randomly <laughs> i'll put a, i'll ask him to put a code here so that you guys can um get a discount for the citrine okay i don't know what code i will use but something is going to be flashing here okay okay so for the citrine all right i mean it's a stack right now gorge um and then make sure to check out i'm wearing aries i know i haven't made the aqua one but this is your nutritional issues okay do check out what i what i what what, what did i say for your zodiac maybe they're gonna put a, a oh wait, let me see where am i okay if i'm here Okay, then they're going to put it somewhere here. Okay, a little bit turn around. She, you know, he's going to work it for us. Okay, maybe they're going to put a video of me turning around there. We'll see. Hopefully they can. So you guys, you guys can see. I am wearing a size medium for this one. Gorge, let's begin the aqua. You guys have been doing a 10-10-10 with the readings. You know, when I did a astrology. Gorge, love the energy. Keep it the pop. Okay, we call it. Okay. <clears throat> Let's begin here from my Aquarius. Let's see here. Okay. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Big transformation is what I see here. I love... Ooh, all right. So we're starting with the Knight of Wands. Fast, courageous, very bold individual that we may be connecting with. Um, this is you enjoying life with as an aquarium but this is you how about we talk about the person you date instead of you you want to do that okay let's see let me tap you there so your person that you deal with is a very much easygoing um fun energetic um but inconsistent because this is a night uh, so let me focus more on them this is a night so chances are you will see them you know like when you go out on a weekend it's fun but then you know like you may expect them to ghost you for a while then you'll see them uh, randomly and then there'll be like a weird awkward moment catching up with each other and then like nothing has happened meaning oh i thought like you know we've been going out for a while and then it's like yeah but i was just i was with my friend so i, I didn't really get to catch up with you but then i'm here again so you want to go out have coffee or go out and drinks and you know it's like a restaurant so they're very open to date you to see you so that's fine that's enjoyable um again like this is a person that you would enjoy time and it's like you know you would feel the connection even intimately you will feel it because it's a knight of wands 
Um, and then, you know, it's like they can also be younger at the same time. Now, being, you know, dating someone who's a knight of wands gets tricky because it's it's like it's hard to get them to commit. And they're very much always like, uh, the next please, the next please, you know. Um, it can be a serial dater also with the knight of wands. Again, it's hard for them to commit because they're about fun, enjoyment, and just, you know, just... You know, it's like who needs to commit basically when we can have this you know so for them it's always about let's not complicate the situation you know that that kind mm -hmm. you have the star card i like how we try to focus on them but then you come out a strong uh, the star card so you aqua right here um it's showing you know like you realize you know your divine purpose you're a person who is who believes in the mystic astrology you could be an astrologer tarot reader or a person who does divination um, you soak yourself in divinity which means that you have a lot of rituals and practices that you do probably during the full moon you believe in a synchronicity um the star that we made here in this deck which is the ankh deck you, normally the star is only one so when we were designing this it was about like let's give it all you know like a path of enlightenment a path of uh, realizing your soul purpose that's why not just one star all the stars are lit up now so in this journey that you have as an aquarian um you what you have is more of um how to say this um what you have is more of like your intuition is heightened your um you know like you're connecting more within and that's why probably you're ent entertaining this person and they love this energy with you they see this in you it feels like it's magnetic attraction and at the same time like for you it's just like all right well you know what you know this person likes me i'm not that 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 into them it's like you're not obsessive at all you're very much staying focused and grounded one feet on the water one feet on the land which means like you're level-headed you don't go in the whole i mesmerize i love you can't be with can't wait to be with you and all that jazz so it's good on your end um for you it's more of like if they text me i text back but don't expect me to reach out first but it's not about a game i'm playing with you justice card is here what they give and basically is what you will take also mm -hmm. so um, for you it's like i just want it to be equal um respect is there um they do come around always sell they will always message they would always try to see me but for me um i can keep my distance also because i just want a balanced normal life i don't need to be um, in their presence every time so you keep your distance here as a justice card um you know your limits it's like okay you know it's like I don't need to be with you every week. I don't need to be with you, you know, um, this, this, and that. So there's part of you that you're saying here that I can maintain this connection without really being involved with them. So you're pretty cool also as a person here with the justice. Six of Pentacles. So clearly you have a good sense of balance with this relationship. You're not being faced when they're not around you because I haven't seen them ever since the night came. Um, for you, it's like, well, they texted, all right, whatever, you know, it's not like I'm involved with them and just like want to be with them. Um, for you, it's all about balance and it's all about doing what is right with the Six of Pentacles here. Um, there is no, um, I feel like for you, and there's no resentment on what they're doing. So for you, it's like, well, it can, we can, fine, if it's just friends and it's just friends, you know, I don't need to, you know, to make this every time a relationship. If they just want to be friends, I'm not faced about this. I'm not bothered about it. I'm just, again, keeping my life balanced. Good. Okay. Then we have the magician. Here they come. Okay. This is a card of like, I want to show to you, prove to you, look at me. That's the magician. So the magician has everything on the table. So when they choose to be more talkative to you or you know, engage in conversation, they use the Ace of Swords. When, when they want to be creative, they would take you out in the nice, uh, I don't know, like um, like a last minute invitation. Let's go here, a road trip with the Ace of Wands. So they're very much go with the flow. And you're also doing that because you as an air sign, you just feel like, well, you know, this is the mode of the relationship or this is the mode of the dating. Then it's so be it, you know they are showing up in your life now as a magician they're single they're available mm -hmm. and it ends there okay so they're very much i feel like you got love bomb by this person but you didn't get uh, you were not a casualty of their love bomb because when they cut it off because magician is like they were putting effort like crazy non-stop and then you have a death card all of a sudden crickets all of a sudden there's no more you know it's like there's no contact here um, they, I haven't seen them. I haven't talked to them. With the death, death card, it is just showing here 
that your person right now is in isolation from you um there was a, an abrupt ending and an abrupt changes in the connection so from something that is hot and then now it's cold and then now it's gone hot cold gone mm -hmm. so that's what i'm feeling here what did it can be scorpio you have a gemini you have a libra also and there it is back again eight of wands so they do this like i can't be reached then they reach out then again i don't see you as being face about this aqua i see you as more of like when they message it's fine i'm not scared i'm a strong level-headed person i can deal with this the eight of wands is moving forward the eight of wands has a direct um honest communication and you don't you don't beat around the bush over here with this person you talk to them straight you do explain yourself to them okay you have the King of Swords, which is you're showing, I told you, you're showing up as who you are. You're a person who knows yourself. So nothing that external, you know, around you affects you from within because only you have control of yourself. And this is what you're doing. Very healthy. Um, with the King of Swords, I choose me. I, I do me. And they, if they, not, not if they want to do me, okay? if they want to see me and talk to me. And that's totally fine. But with the King of Swords, you're nonchalant about this. Um, you're giving them the cold shoulder now. Um, so I feel like first it was hot, but now it's like, yeah, you know what? If you're going to keep doing this and you're the one who's ending it and then starting it, and it's like, I'll just watch here. I'm basically just going to be a, uh, a spectator because this person is going crazy that you're not reacting to them. So it's actually they want to be chased by you, but you don't chase. So that's a problem there. Okay, so let me continue this reading and the grand reveal will answer more of your questions. Oh, don't forget, guys, um, the citrine, I put it down there and the code has flashed there. Okay, so hopefully you saw it. I'll ask them to put a code so there's a discount here. And then ch check out also the Ankh deck and uh, the other things that I recommend for your Zodiac. It's going to be down there and you can you can already check out here on YouTube. You don't need to, I mean, it, it, you will see here all the products already that I recommend for your Zodiac. So if it's a full moon, a new moon, I'll put it right there. So it's always changing. Depends on what the... Um, what the reading is so clearly this is about communication so i'll ask them probably for an aquamarine aquamarine is uh, good for winning in conversations or deals um it, i feel here like you have a star card so i'll ask them also to put some clear quartz so your divine purpose in your healing and a sense of balance of course in your um with the libra which is of course um that would be rose quartz so i'll put a mix down there so okay so but do check it out i'll put it already easy check out guys um it's just down there and of course you know where it comes from it comes from the wonderful store that we have here in studio city and you know this is one thing that i do is like i like to work with crystals and you know manifesting different things uh you know through different frequencies and that's my practice okay so do check it out thank you very much aquarius for watching and stay true to yourself i love that you're you know in the past couple of weeks you are still staying focused you are still staying connected with yourself and you're not bothered. I'll see you guys again. Bye.